morning, good people. For those of you that woke up with a chip on your shoulder this morning, it's time to be productive and do something about it. It's Swag Gatsby's little princess. And your boy Swag Gatsby. And we back with another video. Let's go. Back with another video. I'm Gatsby. Body sit in the channel, we bout to go in LS swaps the small blocks, how you ride? Swag Gatsby and his little princess They providing that content Hit the like button, you see the fine print Alright, good people, so for today You already know what's going on, man It's a real brief video, man I'm just coming to y'all To let y'all know that this car is Out of here, it's sold already Y'all know what's going on with this one I'm about to get the interior I need to move this Okay. Let me get let me get these dogs in the house. Yeah, the little the, Yeah, man. I'm Joe. Yeah. I call a uh, dude that put the gate up. I call him to see if he can he can put me a gate up. He said he'd get back with me sometime this week. So, but yeah, let me go put them up. Yeah, I gotta go put my dog. Oh, you heard she jumping the fence. He don't like that. Real tough, but you know you gotta play nice, man. You feel what I'm saying? Get back. You gotta, you gotta play nice, man. He definitely don't like that. He's like, yeah, that female keep jumping the fence. It's all good though. We gonna get, we gonna get it fixed. But uh, let me turn y'all off and turn y'all back on, man. I know it's probably a little dark in here or whatever, but shit, it's hot outside. We gotta keep that sun out by any means necessary. It's cold as hell in here though. But I'm about to put these dogs up. I'm gonna turn y'all off and turn y'all back on. GPG got motion. Let's go. I ain't even say it yet, but I'm gonna say it in the next segment. Let's go. All right, good people. So I'm back. I don't know my understanding, I'm sure. But yeah, man, I really was just bringing y'all these this video to let y'all know what what the plan was. You know what I'm saying? So let me see if they want me to move this car or not. They want me to move the car. With if you want me to move the car, move the car. But uh, you already know what the two with the T top one. What was going on with the T top one, man? Everything that I was gonna, everything I was gonna do with the uh, with the uh, with Griselda is what I was gonna is what I'm gonna do with what I was gonna do with the T top one. But I had plans for this one too, man. And, Shit just don't go as clean. When she don't feel down. I do got titles, man. But yeah, I'm waiting on my boy to get back for uh from from uh from I'm waiting for him to get back from offshore or whatever. And uh with the interior going it's gonna we gonna get the interior done, man. So that's what's going on. Y'all see my baby. It's been a long time coming. I need to spray that uh I need to spray that uh the damn steering column. I need to paint that. Once I get that painted, then the dash is gonna go in, and uh, I'm gonna put the. I'm gonna. I'm gonna let him do whatever he gonna do with the uh, with the seats. I know what he gonna do with the seats or whatever. Then we are gonna put the seats in, and then we gonna go from there. But as far as this one go back here, man. And if you're new to the channel or you're just here watching, man, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. These my first done dug a hole. I gotta cover that shit back up. But uh, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you know when I'm dropping new videos. But nobody came and got it yet. And my boy Jamal has a wire harness for it. So if I get the wire harness and get it hooked up, then it's gonna be it's gonna be more money. But I got the uh, the burgundy door panels to put in here. I should do that now. Matter of fact, that's what I'm gonna do. But yeah, once again, if you're new to the channel or you're just here watching, man, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you know when I'm dropping these videos and you can become part of the GPG. I know y'all wondering why I'm, I'm looking down. For those of you that know how I'm looking down, then you already know. But for those of you that don't, boy, it's dog shit everywhere around here. But yeah, that's what I need to do. I need to get them door panels and, uh, and put them on there, like I say, to make the car look a little bit more presentable and then even with uh the other car the car that i sold i'm gonna clean that car out and uh 
I'm gonna clean it out just you know make it make it look more presentable to bro he already paid for it so it don't even matter he don't give a damn but that's just how I am man I'm gonna clean it out and uh put all the pieces that I got to the car on the seat so he can see that and we'll go from there but I'm gonna finish this in the house because it's about to rain but I need to get these door panels out of this car so I'm gonna turn y'all off and turn y'all back on when I get in the house and we're gonna have a little conversation you did it ain't it ain't one of them one of them days where you know we just doing car this car that but it's one of them days so I need I do need to cover my baby up I ain't got the uh I ain't got the right car cover for it, even though it said it was for a money car low, but I ain't got the right car cover for it. So once I get the car cover for it, the right car cover for it, I ain't got to keep coming out here in the rain and covering up. But yeah, you know, they working, they over there working. They putting trees, they cut trees down, which is a good thing. But it's about to rain, look at my baby, man. Yeah, I'll stay tuned, man. I know it's, it's it's slow. It's a slow process dealing with me, man, because everybody always be holding their nuts on me. But it is what it is. I ain't going to complain about it. I'm just going to keep on moving. You feel me? So that's what's going on. But this bad baby up out of here. And when y'all and, and when y'all see this, when bro get done with this car, y'all going to be like, damn, y'all ain't even going to think it's the same car. But, man, I fuck with real motherfuckers, man. I fuck with a lot of fake motherfuckers, too. But, you know. I'm trying to get rid of they motherfucking ass. But that's a whole nother story for a whole nother video. But I'm going to turn y'all off when we get in the... I'm going to turn y'all off and turn y'all back on when we get in the house. TPG got motion. Let's go. All right, people. So, I'm back. I know y'all probably wondering, like, man, why he got on the hoodie? Because it's fucking freezing in my house, you dig? It started raining outside like a mug. And I ain't even have my car covered up. That's the most good thing about not having a garage, so... Future references. We're not moving to nothing without no garage. But I just wanted to bring y'all this video, man, to let y'all know, man, y'all gotta manifest the shit that y'all trying to do. But not only do you manifest it, you do the footwork. You can't just say you want something and then think it's just gonna automatically fall out the sky, or you ask God for something that's gonna automatically fall out the sky. See, that's not how it works. The way it works is you ask for something, you manifest it, you speak it into existence. God is not just going to give it to you. He's going to give you the tools so you can get it. That's just my opinion, you know what I'm saying? Because if God was just going around giving shit to motherfuckers that they wanted, then everybody would be happy, you feel me? But anyways... I'm just saying like, man, y'all see the process that I'm going through and it's slow, bro. It's like, it's so slow and it's easy to get discouraged, man, because it's like, I'm right there. And I, and I can't just, I can't walk through the door. You know, it's like me sitting around like, man, I can't wait to, I take off on this YouTube. It's a grind, man. And you get what you put in it. And I know, I don't be dropping videos like I should or like I want to because I don't be having nothing going on. Like, just like me showing y'all the cars out there, I can speak on what what's going on with the cars, but I'm more of a, this what's going on, then I want to show you what's going on with the cars. Like, you know, I had a whole bunch of plans, which I don't make plans. You already know this. I don't make plans because nothing ever goes the way that I planned it to go. But I just been sitting back, man. You know how they say let go and let God. I just been sitting back, man. Letting God do his thing, man. You know, I'm I'm that I'm that I'm that uh what's that when they go to the little clay classes and they they make the you know, you sit around and I don't know, the sculpture, however, whatever it is, but I'm that clay right now, man, and I'm letting God do all the molding and I'm letting him do all this stuff. Like, do I wake up and be like, oh, yeah, I do, but I gotta think about one thing. I I couldn't have woke up this morning, so why complain about shit that I don't have no control over? But as far as my car and stuff go, man, shout out to Bubba, man, at Macmillan Designs, man. He on his way back, so my seats is about to get done. So all I be waiting on really is. Uh, my door panels really you know what i'm saying 
So that's a good thing. So once I do all of that, man, I can go with, I can get the, the, uh, the see, I want to take my, my car to the AC shop and get the AC put in first. Why? The dashboard and stuff out that way. I can just put the dashboard in and work my way around it because it's gonna be it's gonna work work my way around it because it's really gonna be hell putting that dash back in. Like I done did it a couple times and I really did not like it. But shit, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do when you're trying to save a couple bucks, man. And the thing is, man, I figure I go from. Boom, AC. Why my seats and stuff getting done? AC. Put the dash in. Get the sounds put in and the alarm. And then after that, everything else gonna fall into place. Real talk. Like that, that's how close I am to getting everything done. But it was it was a breath of fresh air to, to, to get that call from my boy. Like, man, I'm on my way back, man. It, you ready? You know, so it's been, it's sometimes it's all about being patient, but when you know how life works, man, it ain't patience is really, it, you really, you really want to get that shit done as fast as possible because you don't know what to tomorrow may bring. You know what I'm saying? You might not even get to go off into tomorrow, you know? So I be trying to, I don't want to speak. I don't want to rush into doing nothing. Like I said, don't never rush into doing nothing. But I do want shit to get done in a timely fashion so I can enjoy it. Like, it ain't like I'm going to live forever. But it ain't, you know, it is what it is. It's just being anxious and excited at the same time, man. So you definitely got to trust your process, man. And remember what you started it for, man. Always know that you're closer to your goal than you was yesterday. long as you putting in the footwork to try to get to your end goal then you you good regardless if you taking baby steps or if you running you know what i'm saying yo what everybody else choose to do is on them you know how they do they process how they process work is, is, is it might not work for you you know what i'm saying yeah the door with the rims the raffle is still going on man the rims are right behind y'all i moved them it looked like they've been rolled on and they ain't been rolled nowhere you know what I'm saying? But yeah, so the raffle is still going on. I just had to move them, man. I ain't like them sitting right there. Until I get a backdrop or learn. I got a backdrop. I just don't know how to use the backdrop or work the backdrop. So anybody that knows how to use that, man, let me know in the comment section. DM me on Instagram. Tell me what I need to do because I would rather have a, a backdrop versus y'all seeing the TV shining. Shout out. Shout out to my boy, uh, who we watching? Who on TV right now? Shout out to my boy, Ike, man. Y'all already know if y'all ain't seen this video, man, y'all need to go tap in. You feel what I'm saying? It be your own people, man. But yeah, man, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta trust your process, man. And as far as the cars go, the two cars was for sale. The black and red one sold, it sold already, which is a good thing, you know what I'm saying? Then, uh, the gray one, it's a couple people that's 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 interested in them, but you know, people are more concerned with why I didn't post the price on the page. Like I say, DM me for price, but you know what they say: you want to hide something from a motherfucker, put it in the book, or you know, they they don't read the description. So it is what it is, man. I'm not gonna be trying to defend why I dare or give a explanation why I handle shit the way I handle shit or why I didn't put the price in there. But people get they get caught up in the wrong shit, man. And I was I was I was actually talking to a friend, and it was almost like. They wanted to turn it into an argument so bad, and I'm trying to tell a motherfucker, like, I'm not your enemy, you know what I'm saying? You might not like the things that I say about what's going on, but that's just me being a friend. And then a motherfucker turn around and say, uh, I'm being too, I'm, I'm too manipulative. I'm too manipulative. Uh, you know what I'm trying to say, but my thing is, what the hell I'm gonna get out of manipulating you? See, people don't, they don't use common sense. Why am I, why am I trying to manipulate you? But I feel even crazy trying to explain why, why would you even say that? But some people mental is not all the way there, man. And, and, and when you tell them, man, you need some mental help, they feel like you throwing shade on them or they feel like 
you you hating or you or or whatever however they feel they don't feel comfortable with you telling them the truth and they don't realize it's coming from a place of love like if i tell you bro you need to get some help man like for real you need to get some help don't take it as oh motherfucker you need to get some help we all need help in our own little way i'm not here to judge nobody but if i see something going on with you or i see something off or i see something all awkward or something, I'm gonna say something about it if I if I fuck with you, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that fuck with me though. But yeah, it be coming from a place of love, man. I don't be I don't mean nothing by it. But people tend to take it the wrong way because they dealing with their own inner issues, like they dealing with their own demons. Like yeah, these these young these younger kids nowadays, they ain't got no business being depressed. They ain't got no responsibilities besides they 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 fucking cell phone bill or a car note, if that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but that's another thing. So I'm just all over the place. I just wanted to bring y'all this video, man. I'm a uh, I'm gonna probably shoot a video. If it stop raining, it's supposed to be raining all week. That really does that really killed everything that I had going on and that I had planned, you know. So whenever it clear up, I'm gonna clean that car out for my boy. Like I say, he already paid for the car, and you know the car ain't going nowhere till he come get it. So clean that car out. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna try to make my way to Sprayway. I, I gotta contact Sprayway first before I just say I'm gonna try to make my way to Sprayway. I'm gonna see if I if it's all right if I come out there and pick up a few more things for that car. But I'm, I'm steady trying to tell people like, man, I got I got I paid five grand for the car. Period. That's all I'm asking for. I done put all new trim pieces in it, the back seat in it put another carpet in it. It didn't have no mags on it. Put up another hood on it. Put another front clip on Well, no, nah, that's the same front clip. The defenders and the, that's, that's all the same. The hood not the same though. Put a, what else? What else I put on that car? I put a lot of stuff on the car where it exceeded the, uh, exceeded the 5,000, but at the end of the day, people quick to say oh well i go buy a car that's well go do that you ain't got to tell me that i want what i want for my car and that's just what it is either you want to buy it or you don't want to buy it you ain't got to criticize why why i'm selling my shit for what i'm selling it for but people do that man they they put their energy in the wrong places man and I'm trying to stay away from all that negative energy, bro. I'm trying, I swear to God, like, I just been chilling. You see, my, my barber called me resting, well, what, what's today? Today, Monday? I think he called me Saturday, too. He called me Saturday, like, man, come on, go get your hair cut, man. I'm like, bro, I ain't coming to get my hair cut right now, man. I used to, when I used to be out moving around doing my one, two thing, I used to say, man, I ain't getting my hair cut till I got this much money or whatever. So I'm trying to get back to the, the importance of what's going on, man. You feel me? Money make the world go round. Do not praise it. You feel me? Because that shit could be deemed nothing at, at the drop of a dime. And, you know, you just get it. You know, like my boy say, my boy brother say, man, money just like a pillow in your bed. You know, you could sleep without it, but you will sleep better with it. You know, he didn't say it exactly like that. The way he said it, it was like, damn, I didn't even think about that. But this shit just like a, a pillow, man. Find, peace of mind is what is, is what's real. But, man, find you some real people, man. And I really just been enjoying the people that God been bringing in my life, dog. And that shit just wild because... I used to always say, people that don't know you appreciate you more, man. People want to know what's going on with the car. Shout out to my subscribers, man. Y'all the truth, man. Y'all, y'all, y'all is definitely the truth. Y'all keep me motivated, man. Whether y'all in the in the DMs or y'all in the comment section, man. I appreciate everything, man. You know, from the bottom of my heart, and it's just it's just crazy, man. Because you ain't never think that. You would never think the type of, sh you would never think how people, you know, how people genuinely feel about you. It's, it's easy to find out how a fake motherfucker feel about you, you feel me? But it's hard to distinguish whether, or if, 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 if this person's showing you real love or this person's showing you fake love for their own personal gain. But everybody that's been fucking with me, man, they don't owe me nothing. They ain't, it ain't, they ain't trying to get nothing out of me, bro. They just keep telling me, keep doing your thing, man. 
And you know, for the people that, that hit me up and be like, man, I wish I could have uh, joined the ref or I wish I could have donated, man, you being on my YouTube channel is more than enough, man. You tapping into my video is more than enough. You don't have to physically do nothing to me. I mean, do nothing for me. You know what I'm saying? And, and you got to understand that without the the subscribers, without the supporters, without the people that, that really see you go through what you're going through and they want to see you come, it's almost like a movie. You want to see, yeah, I, I, I mean, I don't know, I'd be... I be, I be, I be rooting for the villain in a lot of movies, you know, like Scarface, you know, shit like that. But you want to see people win, like you see what they went through, and you can, you can, you can tell by a person' energy, man. You can't. People be faking, man. People be really faking, like, and and and, and I can, I can really, I can really expose some people, like I can expose the fuck out some people. A motherfucker might be like, oh well, I can expose you, you what you say about me cannot affect me at all because I'm, I keep shit a buck. You know what I'm saying? I might not tell a motherfucker everything, you know, but I, I keep shit a buck. That's that's the thing, man. Remember, the more motherfuckers know about you, the more detrimental they become, man. And it ain't about what you know. It's about what you can prove. But, man, yo, it, you, it ain't a motherfucker that can tell you I done did some fuck shit. Not one to them. I ain't did shit but keep it a buck. A one, a, 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 a thousand, you know? But it's fake motherfuckers that be around you, dog, that try to use you for your resources. It ain't even gotta be for no money. They try to use you for your resources. They try to use you for whatever they can get out of you. They try to use you for a relationship with a motherfucker that they been trying to get, get to or whatever the case may be. But with those people, and this is just my opinion, because I really don't give a flying fuck. With those people, only time will tell if they've been doing the right thing or not. You know, if, if they was genuine about what they what they was doing, because they gonna always be in the same spot. Bro, my life been like this. Like I don't been to the top of the top in my where I'm at. You feel what I'm saying? I don't been to the top of the top in my life. I don't reach heights that people will never get to. You know what I'm saying? I done been to places that people would never go. You know what I'm saying? I done did shit that I never post on Instagram. Like, I, I posted this little lying about, you know, everybody posts every little thing they do. And this to people that be acting like they overly in the streets and all this shit, man. You ain't got no ops or you ain't got nobody trying to do nothing to you because you post your, your every move. You post your location. If somebody was really trying to do something to you, Man, they could pull up and make that shit happen. People ain't got sense enough to, to take a trip, record the trip, and don't post the video until you get back home. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, 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 just, it's crazy how people post everything that they do, every little thing that they do. Every when they feel in a certain type of way, they go straight to social media, man. Instead of call you, cause they can't call nobody. They ain't everybody fake and fucked up. You know, at least you would have a, a few real motherfuckers out the bunch that bro, you would be all right, everything all right. But man, people run to social media for everything. They could be having a bad day at work and they gonna go to social media. Man, why I was at work in this bit? That ain't for social media. Every little trip they take, they post it. Like. Where, where is your memories at? Where are you gonna? Where is gonna be at? Where you can go look? Like it's so much shit I done did that social media ain't never, never, never seen. That's why I say, bitch, I'm living real life. I'm just going through it. I'm going through one of them. It's one of them dips now. It's a dip right now, but I'm slowly coming up out that dip because I'm, 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 I'm taking the proper steps that I need to to get where I'm trying to go. Now I'm up. Well, I ain't even hit the black yet, but. People just kill me with the with the with the overly real shit. Like they just so real and they so this and they so that and motherfuckers be talking about the bags that they got. I used to be that motherfucker, you know? Motherfuckers talking about the bags they got and they live with they bitch. Or they live with they mama. Or or a female taking care of them. You know, you got the internet parents. You got the parents that dress their kids up just to take a picture of them and put them on internet so it can look like they taking care of their kid. Like, man, do you, man. That's the best thing you can do. Hey, hey. 
do you, man. That's the best thing you can do, man. Get you, you if you love these cars, man. It'll take your mind off of a lot of shit, a lot of life problems, man. Stop. They cutting the trees down there, though. It'll take your mind off of a lot of shit that goes on in life, man. Try to stay away from all of these people that I'm telling you about. You know, try to stay away from them because it, I can I can literally be trying to help somebody and they can take me trying to help them as. Oh, you ain't you you ain't got my best interest, man. I'm not gonna argue with you. I'm not gonna argue with you. If you don't want my help or you don't want my information, man, I listen to what anybody got to say. I don't care if you broke. I don't care if you rich. I don't care if you young. I don't care if you old. You can learn something from everybody, bro. You can learn something from everybody. It, it was a, it's a couple guys, I ain't even gonna say their name. They used to always say, man, you, you should have did this with your car. And I'm gonna be straight up with you. I should have listened to them. But I wanted to, that's just like somebody coming up to me and saying, oh man, don't fuck with that nigga, that nigga garbage. I'm not gonna go off of what you say. I'm gonna find out on my own, you know? But they was telling me about the car. Even my mama was telling me about the car. Like she mad that I sold straight out of the mud. Y'all know where straight out of mud came from. But he was telling me, man, you should have did this, you should have did that. But I wanted to find out on my own. And I did. I found out on my own. I appreciated the information that I had, that he had gave me. But I did. Hey, what, what is information if you don't use it? So that, that was me fumbling the ball. I know people that play basketball better than Jordan. But it don't mean shit because they not in the league. You feel me? So... I'm doing what I do, everything coming together, and when it do come together, y'all gonna be like, damn, y'all gonna look back on everything, because it's a couple people that hit me up like, damn, bro, you ain't did nothing to that car yet. Man, you don't remember when it ain't had no windshield in it? You don't remember when it ain't had no front end on it? You don't remember all of this stuff? Like, how I ain't did nothing to the car? But... It's on me to let that shit affect me. And I ain't gonna lie, it ruffled my feathers a little bit when people say certain shit, but I be having to realize that I'm putting this shit out here to the public. So I gotta be able to take whatever that come in, you feel me? It, I got some thick skin, man, but I'm learning as I go. So it is what it is, man. If you got something that you're doing, regardless if it's dealing with a car, man, the uh, idle mind is the devil's playground, man. You got to stay in motion, man. Everything that stay in motion going to keep motion, man. No matter how big your motion is, whether it's a $10 raffle or a multi-million dollar deal, treat it all the same, you know? I get on here and, and talk to one person the same way I talk to a thousand people. Stay true to yourself, man. Don't let this internet shit fool you, bro, because it gets wicked out here for real. And I'm I'm may, I'm, I'm I'm making a transition to where this is all I want to do. This the only time I'm happy besides when I'm with my daughter. This the only time I'm happy besides when I'm chopping it up with my real ones. This the only time I'm happy, and, 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 and unless you know I'm dealing and, and unless I'm dealing with my car, but this what this all about, man. And I want y'all to know, for the people that tell me I motivate them, y'all are just as much motivation, if not more, to me than I am to y'all. And I want y'all to know that I appreciate that. I really appreciate that. I br I br I'm bringing videos to y'all like this because I feel like I'm neglecting my duties as a YouTuber. But I ain't one of the, I'm not one of the ones that's doing it for no money. I'll show you my AdSense account, bro. I'll, I'll probably get a couple dollars to put in my gas tank. You feel me? But anything is better than nothing because I enjoy doing this. Y'all putting me in a place where I feel, you know, I got, I got, they got my, I got people that got my back. You feel me? I need to learn how to stop putting myself in situations that's going to affect my family or affect the people that love me. You see, you see what I'm saying? So I'm learning a lot dealing with this YouTube shit as I go. But 
y'all just y'all just stay tuned, man, and stick it out with me. Everybody that's been rocking with me, y'all already know I appreciate y'all from the bottom of my motherfucking heart, man, with no cap. And if you can't feel that, man, then you ain't, you ain't, you know, if you don't feel that, man, just keep it moving, man. You got some negative shit to say about me, keep it to yourself, or you can even say it. It don't even matter. It ain't going to affect me, man. As long as you ain't doing no physical harm to me, bro, we good. A pair of lips will say anything, and a lot don't care who tell it. You feel what I'm saying? But I appreciate y'all, man. Y'all need to know this, man. Y'all keep me going, bro. I ain't going to lie. Be ready to flip my shit. I be ready to flip my shit, man. Shout out to the people that talk to me on a day-to-day -day basis, man. People that check on people that holler at me. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all, man. And just watch and wait. Mark my words on this. I'm going to show my appreciation in a different in a different way one day. You know? I'm going to show it in a different way one day. Everybody got their time. Everybody got their time. I seen some shit on Instagram, the realest shit ever, man. Obama was 55 when he retired. Trump was 70 when he started. You had a 22-year-old that, that, that graduated college and became a CEO and died at 55. You had a 55-year-old that became a, a CEO when he was 55 and died at 90. Everybody on the same path and they on the same way. It's just not your time. And I'm starting to realize it ain't my time yet because when my time come, better late than never. You dig? So don't let nothing stop you from doing whatever it is you're trying to do or where you're trying to go, man. If it get in your way, run it over, man. Always bet on you at all times. You would never lose, I promise, man. Slow motion better than no motion. Trust your process. God first, family second, money third. It can always be worse. Back with another video. Let's I'm go there. G body sit in the channel. We bout to go in. Nah. LS swaps the small blocks. How you ride? Nah. Swag gas being as little princess. They provide in that content. Hit the like button. You see the fine print. Cash at the show out band. Like I ain't got sense. L codes, Monte Carlo. Say what you picking. Cut dogs to them Buick Regals. What you flipping? Are you Gucci gang? Or you like the F up on your frame? High sit, nigga. Get them colos. They do their thing. Have you squatting right? Boy, I'm Gats.